All right, in this lesson, let's learn about the first culprit you'll see in the real world, and you'll see it often, and that is the index scan. Now, just because you see an index scan doesn't necessarily mean there's a problem. Maybe you have a small table, and an index scan is a perfectly logical way to look up that data. However, the larger the table, the more problematic. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. So here in our predicate, we're We've got product ID equal to 800. So we just want to find the product ID equal to 800 in the sales order detail table. So in order to do that, we right click and we display the execution plan. And you can see we have a table scan. All right. So oftentimes, SQL Server is giving us some identification that we have a problem and that a missing index may be helpful. And now you have to be careful with these because what happens is you can overcreate indexes. All right? What if you have an index that has almost all of let's take a look at this. Let's right click. And we're going to view the missing index details. And we're going to view the missing index details. And here is this index. However, look at all this. So this is a covering index. It covers the entire query. But oftentimes we might have indexes already that will suffice and maybe we can alter the current index to fill both of our queries. All right. For now, let's go ahead and delete. Let's kill all our indexes on this table. And let's go ahead and take SQL Server suggestion. And let's go ahead and create this index, NCIDX. Again, I like that name nomenclature, 23201. Six underscore the first column name sales order ID blah. Let's go ahead and create that. All right, that finally finished. Let's go back to our window and take a look at the results now. So our show plan here with a index scan. And you can see the estimated I.O. cost there, along with the other costs, the CPU costs. So let's go ahead now and take a look at the execution plan. And you can see now we have a index seek, which is an operator we like to see. And we can see we have dramatically cut down on the I.O. cost. Well, just about every cost there has, has been significantly reduced. So we don't want to freak out necessarily when we see scans. However, the majority of the time when you see a scan operator, hopefully there is going to be a predicate you can use to water down what's returned and hopefully optimize it.